Also, I've got to fire that fucking storm singer of mine. He is definitely not the spawn of Satan. The fuck he isn't. I know what's going on here, game. You can't fool me. Uh-oh. During a nice family outing by the river, everyone suddenly noticed the talented nanny thingamajig. Uh, what's it? Uh, Emma Sande or something? Standing on top of an old tower, smiling and looking straight at my little son. She cried out, I love you, Vagon! And calmly st oh, good lord. Step foot into empty air, falling to the ground with black clothes, ruffling like wings of some old large crow. Vagon laughed diligent, uh, yeah, delightedly and at the loud thump, clapping his hands as everyone stared in utter shock and disbelief. Yep. Demon spawn. Uh, can we please kill the demon spawn? Let's just imprison him. <laughs> just imprison my one-year-old child. <laughs> he's a demon spawn. Everyone's going to be like, yeah, he's crazy. He's crazy. He's, the Emperor's gone crazy. No, you don't understand. <laughs> he's going to kill us all. He can't be allowed to grow up. Now, for all intents and purposes, uh, Arian's going to just completely ignore it. He's going to he's going to refuse to believe it. He's my son. He's not the spawn of, of hell. No. No, he's, he's just a boy. Leave him alone. He's not destined to kill us all and completely wipe out my family tree. Many zealous, ambitious. These are the reasons that those guys hate me. I mean, this king's pretty good, actually. <laughs> He's got relatively good traits. And his heir is even better with the honourable, just brave. I'm very happy with Eamon. Eamon II is going to be good. The, uh, the grayscale's a bit of a bitch. I thought I was going to lose him for a bit, but... Eamon will be the first one to get killed by... Uh, by everyone, I bet. And Gardner's inherited that. We should spend some supplies. For the love of God, man, how long have I been doing this colony? And how long have I been sending them supplies? It does not grow. How much money have I sunk into the fucking thing? It doesn't appear to be growing or advancing at any any speed. His wife's still imprisoned. You might want to let her out, dude. Pop out more airs. The Targaryen line is just shit. <laughs> Do you want to borrow one of my kids? Yeah. Do you, do you want Do you want this kid? Do you, do you want this kid? I promise there's absolutely nothing wrong with him. He'll inherit the Iron Throne. That'll be fine. You'll do fine. Yeah, there's there's nothing really going on. I'm just uh, we're just kind of waiting for those demon spawn shit to pop up and bite us in the arse. Because you know bad shit's going to go down.
Also, it does beg this question. We were at a, we were at, out in a family outing at a river. Where? Uh, at what river were we at? Uh, it's like over there in Astapol for some reason. I don't imagine we were any. Sure. We, uh, <laughs> I suppose. Fuck it. We were in this place, which explains everything. Uh oh. Ah, no, 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 no panic. This is just uh. All oh, right, that's my sister wife who's given me no kids and is a bit of a bitch. I'm pretty sure she's also the one that stepped around with everyone else. Yeah, but no. Go fuck yourself, bitch. <laughs> You're like the least favorite of my wives. The only one that's given me no kids and is a bit of a bitch. I only married you to him because the, you had really no other purpose. <laughs> I read it. We are literally just waiting now for something to happen. Probably... Nope. She's in fact right with my half-brother. She's my eldest, isn't she? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. I don't really have any plans. Uh, I mean, marrying off my kids is kind of difficult because there's not many Valerian guys to actually marry them off to. Can't seem to betroth anyone, sir. So there are like some minor Valerian families that I could branch off into, but really, no one special. I may as well bread, uh, wed brother to sister, because I don't think that the Balerius guys don't have the Targaryen madness traits. There's no, like, pop thing. I think if you inbreed enough, then it'll do that. That's a nice dragon. I don't know. I do tend to kind of avoid the whole Targaryen and breedy thing. Never goes well. <laughs> but then again, I say that, I avoided the shit out of it, and I ended up with the spawn of Satan. So, you know. Yeah. But maybe it was all a fluke. Right? <laughs> maybe it was all a fluke. That crazy bitch was just crazy. She stepped off the tower for absolutely no fault of anyone's. And my kid clapping his hands is just because the Emperor's a bit fucking absentee father and doesn't pay enough attention to his kids. <laughs> Joffrey was crazy as well, but it doesn't mean that he was the spawn of Satan, right? <laughs> right? 
Oh, well, anyway, we'll, we'll skip forward because fuck all's happening. Yep. Literally, as I say that, the things pop up. Anyway, yeah, we'll skip forward. Likely to another event with the demon child. <laughs> it's getting worse! <laughs> My beloved son, Damon. He tried to kill Damon. Uh, uh, Daron or Daron or whatever the hell you want to call him. He, he tried to kill my kid. The one with the dragon egg. He probably wanted the dragon egg. <laughs> He's after the dragon powers. No. No, he can't be allowed the power of a dragon. Uh, some... Uh, yeah. My beloved son claims that some thing tried to kill him last night. He woke up with a small shape pressing down on his chest. It ran off hissing, but left a long, nasty long needle behind. I think it was just a nightmare. The ma maids leave needles lying around everywhere. However, there are dark rumors about that a so-called demon child. My son, they're gone. Again. It's all coming together. He's trying to kill my kids! Choices must be made. Precautions taken! Death, yes, is the only answer. There doesn't appear to be anything that I can do. I, I could imprison him. I think, I, it, like, something, uh, something serious would have to happen in, in order for me to actually kill him. Uh, he's infatuated with... I'm probably gonna marry them together anyway. So, yeah. How sweet. So, yeah, um... <laughs> I'm, I'm dreading that he tries to kill Eamon. Yeah, very well, let them in. What could possibly happen? <laughs> what could possibly happen? My demon child slaughters them in their sleep. Yeah, he gives him an urchin, sure. This urchin will be of great use to you. Right, sure he will. Maybe the urchin can keep an eye on uh, on my kid. I do have a bunch of bodyguards in the form of uh, Unsullied. Not the greatest of Unsullied, to be honest, but... A strange woman with a face hidden behind the mask approaches me and speaks of the powers of the shadow binders of a shy. Uh. I could. But I won't. Mm. Don't I have a position? Yeah, there you go. <sighs> Alright. Uh, there's fuck all going on. Basically, I'm just dealing with... Yeah, I'm, I'm just slowly and surely dealing with uh, all my uh, my half brother's marriage arrangements, arrangements and everything. Like he's not married yet. I've given him that, by the way. Uh, yeah, she's married off to him. My half brother is betrothed to her. Uh, I need to find someone to betroth him off to, and then I don't have to worry about any of my siblings. They're all set for life now, kind of thing. Anyway, we'll we'll skip forward. Like me to another demon child event. <laughs> Fucking demon child. The moment he kills one of my kids is the moment I put the axe <laughs> to kill, just drown him. Feed him to the dragons. Although it will pain me, the child is clearly not right in the head. <laughs> I have to fire that religious guy that told me everything was going to be fine. <laughs> Prick. The demon child really has it in for Damon. 
or Dayron. Yeah, it would be Dayron. Or Dayron. Dayron, yeah. You don't pronounce the E as a Rhaegar, it was Ray E, yeah. So yeah, Dayron would be the name. Yeah, he really has it in for Dayron, I don't know why. He doesn't pick on his younger brother. <laughs> Actually, not even younger, he's the same age, but... But it's the second time he's tried to kill him now. You think that raises a few eyebrows, right? Apparently not, though. Uh... Is that how you spell Daenerys? I'm pretty sure it is. Meh, it'll do. Princess probably Daenerys. I'm pretty sure that's how you spell it. This is off the top of my head. Anyway, I have uh, married... Eamon and his sister together. I have betrothed my daughter to him, who is the heir to... Uh, the heir to the Kingdom of New Grace. They've always been close allies. Ironically, they were like sworn enemies before. Uh, Darren is betrothed to a Seldegar chick. Vagon is obviously betrothed to no one because he's a spawn of Satan. <laughs> to be quite frank, I'm kind of hesitant to even tutor the kid. Anyway, we'll skip forward a bit. Actually, you can see what Aemon looks like. Basically, the identical to all the others, basically. <laughs> Although, imagine him with uh, like half of, half of his face or cheek grey, whatever. But yeah, um. Can't force in the train yet. He hasn't still hasn't married anyone. <sighs> How is my relationship with the spawn of Satan? It's good. Yeah, he likes me. Anyway, we'll skip forward again, see what happens. Well, I'd say see what happens. Wait until my kid murders my other kids. <laughs> son of a bitch! Eamon! My son! No! You fucking demon child! I'm so I need to kill this kid. My dear son Eamon must have suffered a stroke in his sleep last night. He was found drooling in his bed, one eye bloodshot, mumbling about a small monster that stabbed him in the eye before it ran off. There are dark rumors about a so-called demon child. My son, Vagon, again. As always, when something terrible happens, he does seem inordinately happy. He's... He's made my fucking air infirm. Son of a bitch. Fuck! <laughs> Eamon, you were so good! You, was, you were like the perfect heir, other than the grayscale thing. He does have a kid. I have named Baylor. Alright, we need to... How bad is it going to look if I execute my own kid, though? <laughs> Everyone's going to be like, holy shit. Should we, we just imprison him? Maybe if we lock him up. We know it's him, right? We need to do something. We, we can't just do nothing. He'll slowly kill 
all of my airs. I have no choice. I have no choice but to see it done. Atta boy, pop out more airs. Yes. You must you must continue the line. You must continue the line, lad. Faker. Uh, what do we call this? Vekar? That's not too bad, is it? Yeah, Vekar. That's fine. It's Vekar for vacancies. <laughs> It'll do. Prince Vekar. And Prince Baylor. Oh, uh, I'm going to say quick, because I haven't done that in a while. Fucking hell. This demon kid. Fuck this demon kid. He's just screwed with my just, like, smooth succession line. He <laughs> he was just, honorable, diligent, honest, skilled fighter. The only thing, yeah. Son of a bitch. If he goes after fucking... If he goes after Baylor next, I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> This kid! I, I just need to I just need to kill him and let the world hate me for a bit, but we just need to get rid of him. I'm also tutoring him, which is a distinctly bad idea. I think. I don't imagine it has any difference. I'd rather keep an eye on him. But fuck this kid, fuck this kid. Everyone is happily going to Basically, all my vassals are happily, uh... Yes. We all know what must be done. The child must die. For the good of... For the good of the Empire, the child must be removed. I will not lose another heir. I, my, my son... What? Faker. There's no way that's a quint. No fucking way. Where did the bloody fucks come from? Nobody else has the bloody fucks. You stay away from my kids! <laughs> stay away from them! <laughs> yes, just. Yeah, good. Good Antichrist. Yes. You, you, must be, you must be just and ruthless. <laughs> He's gonna kill. Oh shit. Shit, 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 no. No. No, 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 no. That's a bad antichrist. Bad. That's a bad antichrist. Ah, this is getting bad. This is bad. This is very bad. This is very bad. <laughs> Quickly. Darren. Darren, my friend. My son. You. I'm, I, I'm fucking positive. That it's th this kid is the cause of this of this disease now spreading through my home. Aaron, Daron, you 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 must take the dragon egg. Can I not give you the dragon egg? Ah, you already have a dragon. I've already given you a dragon egg. All right, uh, Ego, you're a bit of a bitch. I'm not giving you the dragon egg. All right, my uh, my half brother. What's his face? Died in battle, by the way. Not exactly on the top of my list of my concerns right now, to be honest. I am so going to be killed by this bloody fucks shit. Ah, this fuck this demon child. Ah, it's killing all of my children. <laughs> no, no, we must stop it. We must stop it. Why is this taking so fucking long? All right, fuck it. This calls for drastic action. This calls for drastic action. We must imprison him. Everyone's gonna hate me though. Surely it will trigger any time now, right? It's got like a billion percent. It's my own kid. It's son of a bitch. Now my daughter is contracting it. Now my heir is contracting it. Fuck me, we're just gonna kill the kid. We need to kill him before he wipes us all out! Yep, we need to kill him. Fuck me. Screw this kid. 
He's locked safely away in the dungeon. He... He cannot... He cannot stop us. If I exile him into like the, into the lands of nowhere, right? He'll fuck off, right? <laughs> can we exile him? I don't. I don't think uh, the the emperor can bring himself to kill his own son. I think that's why he's allowed this to go on for as long as he had. You know, role play from a character perspective, he does not want to believe that his son is capable of this. It's his boy, but no, no, it's it's too much of a coincidence. It's all his doing. <laughs> it must be. He must leave and never return. He must leave and never return. All right. Anyway, uh, yeah, we, he must leave. It is the only way. So send the Antichrist to to Westeros. Fuck off. Stay there. Stay away from my lands, Antichrist. There's no way he can he can't hurt my kids when he's in the middle of nowhere in, in Westeros, right? Surely, surely. We've dealt with the problem. Some of us might die from the disease that he's left behind, but I'm hoping that we've just fixed our problem. I imprisoned my own kid. Um, I imagine the disease was still spread, but I'm hoping no more events will pop up with him trying to kill my kids because he's on the other side of the world. I've done what I've had to do. He's in fucking Westeros. I couldn't bring myself to kill him. My character, I don't think my character would ever. He's not his father. He's nowhere near as, uh. He's nowhere near as ruthless as his father was. Vekar survived. Survived the bloody fucks, I think. Sure. It's my nephew. He was also a dragon rider of Blackwing. Alright. I'm hoping that we've averted the disaster and he can just cause hell in, in over in Westeros. <laughs> Go deal with your shit in Westeros. I don't want anything to do with you. He'll like rise up to the top of Harrenhal and then like declare like a giant invasion of shit. I don't know. I'm hoping that exiling him has done enough to save us from his wrath. I imprisoned my own son. That's worse enough. I think that broke the Emperor's heart in doing that. But couldn't bring himself to kill him. That's a step too far. Abandoning a 10 year old kid in the opposite side of the world kind of thing is... I suppose we sent him there under the pretext of relations with the Targaryens. <laughs> Air quotes. You know, take this kid. Yes. Toot at the kid. Yes. <laughs> don't bring him back. <laughs> Do not bring him back. <laughs> we don't want him. Yes. This is, this is when he starts, like, picking off all the Targaryens and rises to the throne. it would be fucking awesome and scary at the same time because he'd likely come for me. Yeah, see, look, this character is right with the Bloody Flux, also known as the Pale Mare, which is to do with the apocalypse. The Pale Mare's death. So, yeah, this is totally the kid's doing. 100 fucking percent, this is the kid's, this is the kid's doing. There's no way they chose that just suddenly pops up. The Pale Mare disease suddenly pops up when we have the fucking kid of Satan just around. We need to see if the people in, uh,. If the idiots in Harrenhal start, like... It's actually the Celtigars who control Harrenhal, so I, I've just, like, killed what is essentially some of my relatives. <laughs> 